Y'all ready? Let's go, let's go, y'all ready? Let's go, let's go. Hey, my connectors, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. Join the family if you like the food. It's the place to be. You come and have a little fun with your girl, can see. What's up, my connectors, and welcome back to the channel. So tonight, we finally got some food, y'all. I don't know what is going on. Everybody's ordering out. It's raining. So let's just jump in. So if you are new to the we got some Chipotle. <laughs> so if you are new to the channel, if you could please hit that subscribe button and your notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video is uploaded. Don't forget to share, like, and leave me a comment. I truly appreciate it. So I have a Chipotle chicken burrito bowl. Okay, and I have cheese, lettuce, I oh, don't see, oh, guacamole, salsa, the mild salsa, um, black beans, white rice. I think that's everything that's on there. Yeah, child, we lucky to even get this. I, I'll tell y'all in a minute. Mm, 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 mm. Everybody ordered that. Everybody. It seemed like it. We were supposed to have um surf and turf because I wanted surf and turf. And then I got a comment that said from Demille that said, My birthday is tomorrow. Can you do some surf and turf? I'm like, girl, we was on the same page. But Longhorn said, I guess they were backed up. So the pickup was gonna be like an hour and a half. Me and Kiana was disappointed because she was gonna order some too. So happy birthday, girl! I hope you have fun tonight, today, this weekend. Even though I didn't even realize how it was raining, I was working on something I would do tonight. I should have ordered my food and heated it up. When I was ready to eat, you know. But I was so in tune with finishing. I didn't even think about eating until I was done. Then I got a little hungry headache. Mm. It's good though. Okay, I got hot sauce. I have tapatio and I have this Tabasco green pepper sauce. Shout out from the boiler, some shrimp. <laughs> that was like this. And then it did. He got, uh, it took, they usually don't take long uh, for like Popeyes and stuff. Because Kiana wants chicken sound. But. That was going to be a long time, too. I said, shoot. Mm. Slow down, baby. It ain't going nowhere. Then you're going to get all full. Sitting up in your chest. Well, anyway, I hope y'all had a great day today. Thank you for watching the video yesterday. I really appreciate it. Mm-mm-mm. I can't believe how fast the day went by. What is that? I'm about to say, what is that? Something I was trying to order to eat? Turn my ring off. Sorry about that. <clears throat> but shout out to all the people that do DoorDash. Trust me, I know. It gets heck of busy. Who y'all use? Postmates, DoorDash, Grubhub. 
I think that's it. Let me tell you, let me tell y'all who I be watching now. <laughs> I watch, I watch crazy stuff sometimes. I watch people that do, um, Instacart. When they be talking about their bat batches. It's sometimes they, they are so funny. But that girl was like, who she think finna bring up <laughs> five gallons of water on the third floor? <laughs> I was like, oh my goodness. But yeah. They make videos about them actually working. And taking people their food. Mm-mm-mm. But I bet it could be fun though. Like you, I don't know if you can have somebody in the car with you or not. <clears throat> well, I guess you can. It doesn't really matter because I think they, I think you can. And y'all just hang out and do DoorDash all day. It'll probably be fun. Especially if you're like a fun person and you with a fun person. Well, fun people just make stuff fun anyway. It, it, they could be doing anything. Just like me and Alicia. Just find anything to do. Be funny. But yeah. I think that'll be fun. You drive for half of the day, I drive for half of the day. <laughs> I was listening to this girl's story time, right? Um, she was talking about her friendships. Well, I don't even know if it's, you can call them friendship because they ain't really know each other that long. But I guess you can consider people friends when you just meet them or whatever. They went on a trip. And they invited people that they kind of knew but weren't really close to. But just, you know, you just know them. Maybe like, you want to go? You want to go? Yeah, I want to go. So anyway, some stuff must have popped down at the beginning of the trip when planning the trip, right? Which happens a lot. You know that. Because one person want to do this. Like some people go on vacation to relax. I want to do all that running around, you know? Some people are a little bit more adventurous. They would, they like, well, I don't want to go on vacation. They'd be laying down. I could have stayed home. Some people go to shop. Some people go to party, go to clubs. When you got six girls, we got six different ideas of what a vacation is. That's just trouble right there. And then if everybody's not being upfront, you know, and just saying, hey, you know, this is what I want to do, or this is, I don't want to do this, or whatever the case may be, stuff just get messy. And stuff got messy before it even, they even went on the trip, but they went anyway. And, um, so of course when you get there, they rent an Airbnb. <laughs> so then they got a problem with, which I've seen this a lot. Who get the bigger room? Who get the bathroom? Who get the view? Who gets this? Who gets that? <clears throat> I'm going to say, they already pissed off or they didn't get their first cocktail. <laughs> Lord have mercy. One girl was like, she just she was ready to go home. 
before the trip even started. And everybody has their own perspective of what's going on, you know? Especially when nobody's communicating. So my question is, how many signs or red flags do you tolerate or accept before you be like, no, nah, I'm not. I don't want to be friends. <laughs> I don't want to talk. I don't want to do nothing. Mine is three. And I think three too many. I don't have to even be a trip. It could just be the person. Like you, y'all just getting to know each other. Y'all just developing a friendship or whatever. Mine is usually three. One time I'd be like, mm, okay, maybe it's me. Maybe I'm just, you know, taking it the wrong way or looking at it from a different perspective. Or, you know, overreacting. You know, I do a little hole, okay. Then the second time. Oh, now, wait a minute now. I don't think it's me. <laughs> That's your second time. Then that third time, I'm like, okay, that's confirmation. Now you, I used to be like one and done, one and done. But now I just be like, okay. You can't just make stuff work. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about in any relationship too. Them red flags be like, they don't even be flags. They be like in your face. I wonder why we choose to ignore them. And then when it's over, you look back and be like, yeah, you silly. But yeah, it was a disaster. From start to finish. I was like, mm-mm. And then it just get messy, because they, they go to tagging each other and... <laughs> I was like, oh, MG. I think it's because some people are really hurt and devastated. Especially when you get somebody two, three, and four chances. Mm-mm. This is right on time, y'all, because I was hungry. But, yeah. How many chances do you give somebody? And I know we done talked about the whole forgiveness thing so many times on this channel. You know my policy. Forgive them, but don't give them access back into your life. So I know. See, I'm already getting full. <clears throat> Guacamole is so good. I love avocados.
avocado sour cream. I need to try Moe's. Because a lot of people be like, Moe's tastes better. I'm going to try the burrito. Let's see what it's talking about. I never had Moe's. I don't think I ever did Moe's on this channel. I don't think. I never did Moe's. I never did The people even eat Long John Silver and Captain D's. I never did checkers or rallies. I don't think I've ever done Hardee's. <clears throat> I think I've done everybody else. I believe. Black beans. Black beans are pinto beans. <laughs> I go with black beans. Brown rice or white rice? Sometimes the brown rice is hard. So I go with white rice. Sour cream, sour cream, <laughs> sour cream or guacamole or bowl. We're just going to build you a bowl right now. Do you get lettuce or you get the fajitas like peppers and onions? get corn. I used to, but I don't get no more. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I was like, oh, I have a mission. Then I saw this girl. She was in the screaming. I thought she had like plastic surgery. I thought she had gotten her body. You know how you do the mommy makeover, you can get your body done and stuff. That's what I thought she was in pain from. <clears throat> and that she actually told her story and she got, you know how they say, you know, 14 times. I was like, oh my God. That is so sad. And she was in excruciating pain. But her boyfriend didn't make it. A lot of people got a lot of stories and trauma. You know? I be sitting up crying. 
I know people say you're supposed to protect your energy and stuff, but I just... You know, you just gotta... You know, I feel people. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, good, y'all. I didn't mean to sit there and eat all that that fast. Oh, Tammy, that shirt fits. That's what I was saying yesterday. Different shirts from different companies, they fit different. But that fit, it fits. So I'll take a um, video when I wear it. That's a big old piece of chicken. I'm almost scared to eat it. All right, y'all. It's not going to be long. We was finally able to get something to eat. But we'll have surfing turf sometime this week. I almost ate all of that. They wouldn't, um... They didn't skimp out on you. Sometimes they, they be kind of like barely putting stuff on them. They loaded this one up. That's it. That's all. I hope y'all have an amazing week this week. Have a blessed week. Safe week. So, oh. I'm going to get this out So, thank y'all so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. <laughs> much love, peace, and blessings to each and every one of you. And until the next video, continue making connections with endless possibilities. I love y'all. Bye, y'all.